In this video, I would like to show you how to accept or reject edits that have been made to your document using the track changes function in Word. When you get a document back from your supervisor or a collaborator, and when they've used the track changes function, you will see that edits reflect in a different color. With these vertical lines indicated that an edit has been made in the relevant line. Before you start, go to the review tab and switch track changes off. There are quite a few ways to deal with these changes, to either accept or reject them. If you would like to accept this change, you can either click on the main accept button, which will go to accept and move to the next change, or you can click accept and move to next. You can also click on accept all changes in document. All three of these options are quite dangerous because you may accept changes which you are not aware of and not completely agree with. For example, in this case, if you accept this change and immediately move to the next without reviewing the end product, you will see that both spaces have been removed. For that reason, it's better to either right click and say accept or reject or click accept change without moving to the next change immediately. In this way, you can add manually add the space between the and prevalence and then move on to the next change. In this case, you'll find the vertical line, but it's not clear where the change in this line have been applied. It's most probably because a, a space have been removed. In this case, again, you can use accept and move to next, but the safest is just to highlight the area and click accept change. The same thing may happen when it comes to tables where we're not clear where the change have been involved. And again, accept change. Track change is a useful tool when it comes to editing your documents if you know it well.